So now that we toured this 2456 Fleetwood entry level home, this is the open floor plan as you can see if you wanna see the full tour, check out the link in the description. But right now we're gonna head over here and we are going to this home next door. It's another entry level Fleetwood, but it's right here. And so we're gonna to tour this home right now. So if you are new to the channel, this is the Manufactured Housing Expert channel where we help you make a more informed decision when purchasing a new or pre-owned manufactured home or tiny home. So make sure you hit that subscribe button and ring that bell to be notified when we premiere new home tours. If you have any questions, we'd love to hear your questions in the comment box. We do our best to answer all your questions. So this is the home that we just toured and now we're here on this home. I know the sun's really bad, but the difference between these two, like I said, are a open floor plan and then a more private floor plan with a wall dividing the kitchen and living room. So let's go inside. But you see that wall and that tall island? There's pros and cons to it. Some people like the privacy. And also you're gonna see on the other side what it adds to um, what, what you add, what value it adds. So you could easily put three or four bar stools there. You could fit a nice four to six person dining room table there but it just makes this feel a little bit more enclosed, but there is an asset, there is some value there. And again, this is an entry level home from built by Fleetwood. And so one of the benefits to having this is we created a place to put your food, a pantry. So it did allow us to add more pantry space um, and some people like it because it creates more privacy between the kitchen and the living room when you have guests over. But this is a very nice size kitchen. Beautiful. I love the wood cabinets. So again, you'll notice in the other tour that there were different cabinets, but these gray, I'm sorry, I said wood, these gray cabinets, they are very nice. Laminate countertops, which are standard. So we're gonna back up here so you can get that view and over here to our left. In both of these homes, they're good size utility rooms, side-by-side -side washer and dryer. Again, this is, does have a long hallway like the other home, but you could fit easily a, a double, a twin, a queen in this room. And so, I'm sorry, I said this one was a three bedroom. This one is a two bedroom. This is a little bit cozy of a bathroom. And right behind this door is where you have your toilet. So it's a little cozy, but at least it's, you do have a full bath, a shower tub combo. Now as we enter the master bedroom, tell us what you think about this home in the description, we love to, or I'm sorry, in the comment section. It's been a long day today, but I'm so happy and glad that I get to show these homes to you. A good size closet, and check out this bathroom. I like it, it has a his and her sink. Look at all that linen closet space right here. That's really nice, the vanity. We always like to do a walk-in 60 inch shower in the master, bathrooms so this was a quick home tour really appreciate you guys watching we're here for you hopefully you liked it enough to help me out hit the like button if you have any questions leave them in the comments we will do our best to answer them and thank you very much for watching this addition to the manufactured housing expert channel